Okay. Um, Okay, so we're, we've got a solid disc um, rotating without slipping on a plane with um, some velocity v, and it wants to know a and b. So what is uh, v a and v b? Um, okay, so. We're rolling with it slipping, so we've got um, both our, and so we can kind of rationalize here. So here, this guy is actually going to be quite large, and this guy is going to be at an angle. The reason why I say that is because VA is going to be our uh, center of mass velocity, plus our rotational velocity. Um, actually, both VA and VB are going to be our center of mass velocity plus our rotational. Um, now, if we break these down, our, our rotational velocity is, um, is omega R, Um, but, oh, but then omega is our center of velocity over our r, and so then, um, that means that our vr is just our, our central velocity. Now at a, This is our V C times um, X hat, and our radial velocity is also V C times X hat, and so this just equals two V C X hat. We're given in the question that's four meters per second, so it'd be two times four meters per second, which equals eight meters per second X hat. Now at point B, it's going to be our central velocity x hat plus our central velocity in the y hat direction. So that'll still be four meters per second x hat plus four meters per second y hat. Um, and it asks, what is the speed? So our speed is our magnitude, so it'll be root four squared plus four squared, which is equal to the root of 32, which is 5.66 meters per second. And so our magnitude at A is just eight meters per second. Okay, so checking through the solution here, so we get this, so the speed of A is 8 meters per second, and B is 5.66, so that looks good.